You're here to sell some books? Okay, great. Just gonna take a look at them one by one. Okay. First we have Severance by Ling Ma. Before I get started looking at the quality of the book, I'm just gonna type in the SKU and see if we have a lot of these in stock already, okay? We have three of these in stock. It does look like it's in excellent condition though. This is a fantastic book. Those post-apocalyptic ones. See, do you have any highlighting or underlining in this book? Nothing you can think of. What about the cover if I take that off? Okay, it does look like it is in excellent condition even though we do have a few in stock I think we could take this one definitely so I'm gonna put this in a heat pile interesting the lives of a cell this is a very old one isn't it Very old. Even has an inscription here. Merry Christmas 75. And a phone number. Like this typography up top. Notes of a biology watcher. Lewis Thomas. Let's see. Copyright 1974 by the Viking Press. Let's just see the back of this real quick. We are used to bookstore, as you know. So, we do take used books. Don't expect this one to be in great condition. I am going to put this in. See that one here? No surprise, we do not have this one in stock. Since it is an older book, I do think it would be nice to have a copy of this. It's a little bit of discoloration here, but it comes with the condition of this type of book. Where did you find this one? Mm. Some nice crispy pages, I like that. Okay. And look, we've got author photo here. in the keep. Right, interesting. The Magician's Handbook. Looks like this is from a library. An illustrated guide to the art of magic. I'm just going to open this up. Nice old pages. 
like a book with the old pages. They feel much different. Used. Yes. We do have an entire magic section here. Let's see if I can find. it, but I will look for it, the name. Okay. Robert Parrish. Mm. Okay. Okay, we'll take this one too. Darkly comic and vulnerable and true. Let's see. Let's get that eyes behind. Hmm. Interesting. For some reason, that one isn't showing up. And the last name. There we go. Unfortunately, it looks like we do have many of these in stock, so we're not going to be buying this one today. Would you like me to write up a receipt for these? Okay, great. Address. Would you like cash today or credit for the bookstore? Credit. And I'm just going to have to write these out. Okay, we can give you $12 for this. Very excited about the lives of a cell. Okay. okay. Give you fifteen for that. Since we have so many copies of Severance, I'm only going to be able to give you $7 for that. Yeah, even though it's in excellent condition. So you can just keep this slip. We're going to keep this our records and when you want to use this one just bring it back and we're gonna have ours here okay. thank you very much are you checking out all right oh Eileen this is a great one yeah it's the same author as my year of rest and relaxation I actually like this one better I 
make sure it's all in good condition. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's Stephen King. Are you a big Stephen King fan? Interesting feel on the cover of this. It's kind of like a rough texture at the bottom and a much smoother texture on top. You can hear the difference. Getting the last one. Lucky you. Here's some of these pages, if you don't mind. Oh, I love this type. Kind of like a typewriter, courier. All right. You're all set. Thank you so much. Enjoy your books. See you next time. Very old copy of The Catcher in the Rye. What an interesting cover. This one, I haven't seen this before. This unusual book may shock you, will make you laugh, and may break your heart. But you will never forget it. Love these old vintage copies. Two fifty. Such delicate pages. First printing was in nineteen fifty three. I do think this will be very nice in our collection. Okay. And Gulliver's Travels. Alright, there is some writing on it. Mm -hmm. I see some more writing in here. It's also very delicate. when we have the little dog ear too that isn't exactly what we're looking for it's a very interesting copy but I don't think we can take this one today love the cover of this very very nice thick page. Looks like it is in excellent condition. This is a nice one. I'm just gonna look this up real quick. We don't have any copies of that. Uh, 
and the last name. Do you like credit or cash? Mm hmm. Okay, no problem. You just write out this receipt for the cashier. Total is 18. Thank you so much. I'm very excited about these books. So I'm going to keep this one, take this, this copy, and just bring it to the cashier and they'll give you your cash. Thank you so much. You'd like to check out? Okay, great. Oh, what a good one. I love this book. My Sister the Serial Killer. We have had, I don't know if you've heard me mention, um, a small child come in and just highlight and underline books. So before I sell them, I'm just checking, doing a quick perusal. Make sure you're not going to be getting a copy. I just don't want you to have to come back and be upset, but this looks like a clear one. Okay, spine looks good. Cover. Everything looks good. My scanner isn't working, so I'm just going to type this in. Okay. Right here. Next one. Oh, this is fun. Laughable limerick. I love seeing these old books that came from the library. This one was Columbus Avenue and West 83rd Street. 1965. Okay. I'll just take a quick scan through these pages. Oh. Looks like we got one here. Sometimes with these old library books, you know, they just come as is. Straighten this out. pages. Excellent. Hello, 
You have to pick up an order? Mm -hmm. What's your last name? Okay. Right. Pizza Girl is the book. You got an email. I do have it here for you. Here it is. Just make a note in here that you picked it up. And I'm going to write a little receipt for you. I know you already paid online. is just saying that you're paid. Okay. Thank you very much.